don't you turn around and start laying hands on people. This is not just for the ministry, this is for whosoever will. Let it come and take it. When you begin to pray for somebody else to be blessed, God's going to bless you. But if you're not willing for somebody else, I want you to turn around and lay hands on somebody. Praise the name of the Lord. Get a hold of somebody and take him to pray more. Say that the Lord will not have us. Bless your name. 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 Bless your name.
y'all go real loud for preaching you all just have around here. I tell you what, to go and hear this, you'd have to go to a minister that comes around maybe once he calls short on my high every two or three years. Because I'm telling you what, not everybody can preach like Uncle Gordon. And I'm telling you what, as much annoying out there, he's he shot on my high. Tell me to go out and have everybody in this church on shout. Let me tell you, one of these days, I'm on my high, shot on the up, on my high. You're going to have to stand up for Jesus. You're going to have to walk out. You're going to have to step out on faith. You're going to have to realize that God is real. That the anointing is here. And if you don't step out in trouble, I love my high, so I love my high. He says he's here to bless his people. He's here. He's here. He's here. He's here. He's here. He's here. How much more does it take? I love my high, so I love my high.
saith God. I was prophesying and speaking forth that which was going to be. I was prophesying yea, even of myself through my prophets, saith the Lord. And yea, so many have read it time and time again and didn't even hear my voice speaking through my prophets. And yea, they were always speaking and referring to me and what I was going to do, saith God. Are you listening tonight? Have you heard tonight what I had to say? How many of you are going to humble yourselves before me, saith God, and repent of not getting on your knees, and repent, saith God, of not seeking my face so that I might dwell in a greater measure in your life, and I might fulfill all that I've spoken through you and in you, saith the Lord. Woo! Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus, I praise you. Glory to God. 
Thank you, Master. Thank you, Master. Hallelujah. 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 I'm preparing my bride, saith the Lord. And you will either prepare yourselves to meet me or you'll be left behind. It's just that simple, the Lord says. Prepare your hearts. Prepare your lives. Get everything in line the way it should be according to my word. According to my plan, saith the Lord. And then you'll go home with me when I appear in the eastern sky. Yes, saith the Lord, my coming is nigh. But so many even in my church do not even see or realize how close I am to coming. Yea, many are crying out to me even at this very moment. Come Lord Jesus. Come Lord Jesus. Come Lord Jesus. How many of you tonight are even crying that out for me to come? Many will not cry because they're not ready, saith the Lord. Yea, it is high time that each one of you begin to examine himself before me and say, God, everything that is in me that you did not put in there, Lord, would you remove it? Would you remove it, Lord, that I could begin to measure up to what you created me to be, that I could begin to be that firebrand for you, full of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah to God, beginning to speak forth words of wisdom, words of knowledge. Hallelujah everything that you put Lord in the body of Christ let it all begin right here Lord I pray in Jesus name amen let it begin in me Lord amen hallelujah hallelujah God I pray Jesus hallelujah thank you Jesus